lot of stone. Yeah, I am actually quite surprised that the uh, single player client is actually um, better than the server at this, at supporting itself. I think that's quite surprising. Oh yeah, I need to show you guys the big room I dug out. Uh, off camera as well. That's what I'm going to do when my team is constructing things. I think. I do need to show you it to you actually. It's very important. Alright, cool. Let's go across here. Well, you'll probably see it when I start building everything. I need to upgrade my furnace a bit as well. Because it's very, very slow at the moment, and I don't like it being that slow. Well, we have almost everything we need now that we've got close down. Not a very good nether portal spawn. Yet there is a fortress right there, so I suppose in some ways it is good. I guess. In other ways, it's bad. It's not good and bad about it. Alright, okay, so. Here we are. Back in, in the house. So, first of all, let's build ourselves a. One, two, three, four, five. So this is to upgrade my furnace. Just to make it faster than it currently is. Uh, we now have an iron furnace, which is a little bit quicker at smelting things. I think I will probably go for... Hmm... You know what, I think I'm going to go thermal expansion for my first machines. Because I'm quite accustomed to thermal expansion now. Because I just, I've always used it for quite a long time. I'll just keep this four channel for later then. Um, but before we can do any of this, we have to make a quick machine. Two of you. Two of you. One of you. Well, the glowstone, I've got the iron, I've got... Ooh, what else do I need, actually? I need to obsidian. I think that's it, actually. Let's do it. So this is... Cauldron. Two redstone. These... Obsidian. The glowstone dust, and that... Uh, and that gives you the energy manipulator. Which is, uh, as you may or may not know, the energy condenser, effectively from, you know, the energy condenser from E2. It is effectively that. Um, so we've got this now, put up there. Oh, it's even got a weird base on it. I think that's like the alchemical, not the alchemical table, the, that's like the transmutation table's bottom, I think. Something like that. <laughs> Something along those lines. Um, right, so that's good. We've got that now. So, as you may or may not have noticed, when I hold, when I hover over something, it says that it's got an EV value. Those are like how much energy it's worth, basically. 
so an iron ore isn't worth anything, but when I grind it down to dust, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine apparently, uh, the iron dust still doesn't have anything, however, iron dust, as you know, is two iron, and iron is two, five, six is its value. I don't care about wasting coal on them, that's not an issue. Particularly. What? That's not blacking, that's white. That's so weird. It's clearly white, not black. So 256 is the value of an iron ingot. So as you see here, glowstone's worth 128, so if I put two glowstone in there, I get another iron ingot. Pretty good. Um. If I put in sapphire, which is worth quite a bit more, you get quite a lot of iron from that. So I do need quite a bit of iron, so that's fair. So if I take out whatever's in the top slot there, everything just gets consumed for value. So what I now need is some gold. Some gold, do I have any gold? I must do somewhere. I mind quite a bit of it. Um this could be an issue. Oh no, there it is. I'll smell these all up later when I've got better stuff. When I've got like better stuff, for it. when I've got better equipment for this sort of thing, then I'll, then I'll sort it out. Oh, that was me sneezing. I sort of just stopped myself from sneezing properly. <laughs> so gold's worth 4096, so we can get a bit of gold out of this, not too much though. I didn't mean to run from that. Good thing it didn't break actually when I did that, because sometimes it can break, that's why I have to be careful about it. So we've now got quite a bit of gold, which is nice. I do I have any sand anywhere? I hoped I did, but apparently I don't, so that's fine. I'll just go get some from my over here. Actually, you can grind down cobblestone in the grindstone, but oh, I'll just do that. Come on, let's do it or Got some grass, but we can grass. So I'm going to build some more buildings, I think. So probably going to need like a machine room or something. Okay, this room is a bit crowded with stuff. <coughs> yeah, it is. Definitely. So I'm gonna just grind this one cobblestone down into pieces. I don't know how many turns I have to do on it. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Yeah, there we go. Eight. Eight seems to be the number. So, sand is worth one, so I'm just gonna make another sand. Using. Uh, wow. Well, Rosen. Rosen as well. So, we got a bit of sand now. Let's put in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Put it in there. So, that makes eight glass. <coughs> this is to be more preserving with the emerald now, apparently. Change the way that we're gonna do that. I don't know what the use of the magnetic floor is. Well, actually, to be honest with you, it's a special magnetic. Is it? Can it just use molten stuff? Molten shape water or something? I assume so. Yeah, it must be something like that. I have no fucking clue. To be honest with you. Um, so we've got a bit of grass now, that's good. So we can now build ourselves a machine block, I think. From thermal expansion. Thermal expansion machine block. There we are. Machine frame, it's called. It's fine. Two copper. I need some bricks, so I'll smelt four of these. Or five of these would be better, actually, I think. Oh, that's interesting. Uh, the machine frame has got holes in it, but this one doesn't. 
What is that? What is this one? Hold on, it. It's just too many others, man. It's weird. Uh, I would have thought we'd shot all the guns in my hand, but it doesn't appear as though I want to To be fair, when I have it next to it. Uh, if I hover over it, then it's got holes in it, but if I have it there. Yeah, it's because it's, it's too dark and then catchy. Alright, so I got some bricks. So we just go brick. Brick. Lots of bricks. Lots and lots of bricks. And then we can use all those flowers. Because they're actually useful. So the, the redstone furnace requires a redstone reception. Well, which requires a bit of redstone now. I'll just take all of that. Yeah, gold in there. Okay, that's our reception coil. I think I can just now do that. Yeah, we are. Redstone furnace. Nice. We are definitely going to need a machine room and some power. I'm not sure what kind of power we need. Actually, I do have an idea of what kind of power we need. Ender. Ender tank. I'm going to use an ender tank from Ender Storage Mod. Because it's cool like that. So I need a cauldron, four blaze rods, two obsidian, a wool, and an ender pearl. I don't have any wool, but I do have string. And string is wool if you make it like that. I have quite a bit of string actually. I really need to sort out my chest at some point, so I need... I actually need, like, um... Four obsidian. So what we want now is a um for the anti tank, so now we need some let's throw them on mission fluid ducts. Where are they? There they are. Fluid duct I think, which is a lead and two copper. It's a little bit more expensive to do this way actually than using the hard glass method, which is the normal way. And it's also you can't see through it with this method. But I don't have any hardened glass, so <laughs> it's best just to leave it as it is and just get on with it. Four, five, six, seven. Yeah, it does seem eight is the number for this. Um, all right, so we've got pretty good armor. We've got good stuff. I didn't. I don't normally make armor, but. It seems kind of necessary to see how we're going to the nether. I don't know the rock wall though. It doesn't actually say. So you have a way to make this thing. I have a lead. So you go. I'm going to need some more copper actually. I'm just going to get like that much copper. And I'll get a bit more lead as well. No, we don't really need too many for the docks, but a few would be quite nice. Not gold. Yeah, 24 for the docks, nice. So then the next thing we're going to need is a, um, 